girl Carisha from travelwithcarisha.com and I am here today to talk about one of my favorite things in the whole wide world, candles. So I am here today with a review of pomegranate lemonade. Now what I do is I have a four point scale, 25 points for each category to total 100 points and I rate my candles. So each category, scent, 25 points, maintenance, 25 points, wick, 25 points and throw 25 points so are you interested to see where this baby landed on my scale and do I recommend for you to buy this candle stay tuned and find out so let's hop right into the first category which is normally the most important for a lot of people and that is the scent this the notes in this candle is juicy pomegranate, zested lemons, sugar crystals, of course, with your essential oils. Bath and Body Works knocked this out of the park. This combination of pomegranate and lemonade is, is a match made in heaven. It smells just, this candle was beautifully made. So if you're into fresh, clean scents a nice spring scent this is your candle so you do get your lemons and you get your pomegranate so kind of like a maybe like a juicy starburst skittles type candy um just a fresh scent kind of like clorox wipes but um so take your clorox wipes add pomegranate and add some sugar and mix it up um minus of course the chemical smell but this this the scent is just they did a phenomenal job, a phenomenal job. I'm very happy with the actual scent of the candle. So out of 25 points for scent, I gave Bath & Body Works their entire 25 points for scent. Let's move on to the next category, wicks. The wicks on this candle look great. Did not have a lot of issues on it at all. Um, they do recommend for you to, before each use, to trim your wicks one fourth. And I did that a couple of times. I don't do it all the time because then you don't want the issue where your wicks are drowning. Did not have the issue of my wicks drowning in this candle, nor did I have the little flower that it creates at the top when it's a little bit too thick. The wicks were perfect. So um, I gave this 25 points out of 25 for wick. Now let's move on to my next category, maintenance. Maintenance is very important because we just don't have time to babysit candles all day. Constantly having to trim, having to cotton ball your candle because um, there's too much wax or your wicks are drowning or you know, what have you. Did not have a lot of issues, did not have to do any maintenance really whatsoever on this candle. Um, my wicks didn't drown. Um, just not a lot of not a lot of issues so for maintenance which isn't always the case <laughs> some of these candles i have to put tents over i have to clean up um the um the wax because maybe there's too much drowning so for it to not have any maintenance issues that is saying a lot so for maintenance i gave it 25 points out of 25. now let's get into my last category the row now, for those of you who don't know, throw is just how much it um, fills the room, you know, the throw of the scent. So when you walk into a room or when you're sitting in the room, does it fill up? Does the aroma fill it up now on cold? Um, it has like a medium throw on cold. You can really smell that pomegranate lemonade. But unfortunately, I did have to deduct points in this category because it just did not have a strong throw when you light the candle so it just did not have the um ability to fill the room like i needed it to so what i would suggest is to obviously maybe put this in a bathroom or a smaller room because for me it doesn't fill up the room and i've tried it um you can see i burned it quite a bit so i've given it many opportunities and the rooms I light it in aren't all that big because I've, I've used it in my office and in my bedroom is a little bit bigger. But And another thing you can do is you can light it with another candle. So what I do is I take the pomegranate lemonade and the champagne toast and I light them together. And then sometimes I'm able to get, you know, um, a little bit better 
of a throw in the room with the combination of the two candles. But unfortunately, on the throw, I had to deduct points. So out of 25 points, I assigned 15 points to this candle. So actually, not bad. This is one of my favorite candles. I would at least say top 10 because the smell is just so delicious. It's so fresh. So we're talking spring, summer, with a little bit of Skittles, a little bit of star Starburst candy. Excuse me. So I am really into the clean, nice, fresh scents that don't have a lot of um, a lot going on. So this for me is one of my top 10 candles. So scent 25. Maintenance 25, Wix 25, and unfortunately throw 15 for a grand total of 90, which really actually is a great score. The candles that get 100, 95 or above, and you know 100 are just top of the line, the best of the best. But so for pomegranate lemonade, do I recommend it? Absolutely. I think um, you will like this candle. It will make your house smell really good. Um, use it into a medium to smaller room and you shouldn't have issues or combine it with another one of your favorite candles so bath and body did an excellent job pomegranate lemonade will go down as a favorite and hopefully they keep it around and bring it back next year so let me know do you have pomegranate lemonade what is your experience and do you agree with my score that I gave it a 90%. Thank you so much for watching. Please subscribe to my channel and let me know which candle reviews you would like to see. Have a good day. Bye.